We're going to change gears to a developing story we're following in Loudoun County, where sheriff's deputies are looking for a man who pulled a gun on two women. The first incident happened just after 6 this morning on Lynn Haven Square in Sterling. A second a short time later. It's a similar case. It was reported in McKean Court. That's in Great Falls. Our Richard Reeve is live in Sterling with the latest on this investigation. Richard. Well, Chris, we're in Lynn Haven Square. It's a nice townhome community. It's a kind of an enclave off of one of the main roads here. So the notion of staging an armed robbery in this location has a lot of folks concerned. On a dreary December day. It's disconcerting, you know, makes us worry. A crime alert in two Loudoun County neighborhoods. Using the gun to commit a crime I do have an issue with. Less than two miles apart. There were police cars here and police cars here. Police say around 6.15 Sunday morning, a man approached a female resident here at Lynn Haven Square in Sterling and at gunpoint ordered her to drop her packages and take off some of her clothes. I would never think that something like that would happen in this neighborhood. It's a pretty safe place. The woman somehow managed to escape safely, but then just before 7 a.m., another armed confrontation a McKean Court in Great Falls. A lady was unloading her groceries and um, a man approached her with a gun. She screamed and he took off. In both neighborhoods, lots of kids, but also active block watches. In this neighborhood, we tend to keep an eye out for one another. Uh, just the hour on a weekend was weird. Especially, you know, our neighbor right next door. If he knows anything, he tells us right away, like, hey, keep your eye out, this is going on. Residents say they are grateful no one was hurt. To have this happen so close to home, it's like, wow. But amid the holiday decorations, many vow they will be more watchful, even during this festive time. We were pretty stunned. This is a really safe neighborhood. And we should also mention at the Great uh, Falls location, police asked residents to shelter in place for a short time. Only a vague description of the suspect right now. And investigators are looking into the possibility that these two incidents were linked. Residents around here say pretty much all they can do is try to be on alert. In Sterling, Richard Reeve, ABC 7 News.